these these big events are not necessarily actually a great indicator of that. Uh, even though both campaigns would love you to think they are, every time Trump holds a packed rally with lots of people cheering and chanting his name and engaging with him, um, the Camelot team will put out their own video saying, look at our rally, it's just as exciting and people are just as enthusiastic and a lot of that is down to actually sort of showmanship and production quality and 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 that kind of stuff rather than necessarily how many people are going to vote for you. So yeah, I think um that stuff should be taken with even more of not so much a pinch of salt, but um a nice kind of brine saline solution uh before you read too much into rallies. Celebrities are quite important in some ways. Um look, you know, if we're simply going by more celebrities, then Hillary Clinton would have been president in 2016. She had lots of celebrities endorsing her. Uh, celebrities, I think, can be often be overrated. Um, a lot of people will say, oh, you know, I love this person's music or I love this person's movie or whatever, or I love this person's um, business ventures. That doesn't mean I'm going to follow their advice when it comes to politics. Uh, you know, uh, Taylor Swift may be the biggest pop star in the world at the moment, but that doesn't mean that every single person who listens to her music is going to go and vote for Kamala Harris. Um, likewise with, with Musk, I think, one of the reasons why Trump has uh, held Musk quite closely in this election campaign is one of the demographics, which is a swing group, um, is young men in particular. Young men who are maybe a little bit left-leaning, but are not super invested in politics, are unlikely to vote. Uh, Musk tends to have a bit of pull with that crowd. And um, I think that's the hope of, of of putting Musk out there on the campaign stage is to say, look, you know, I'm the candidate for you guys. Uh, and and uh, that's why you should come out and vote for me. And maybe it'll work. I think it, it remains to be seen, actually, how much impact a personality like Musk has on the election. Um, for what it's worth, I think, I'm not 100% sure whether Taylor Swift endorsed Hillary Clinton. I think she did endorse Joe Biden in 2020. Uh, but uh, yeah, no, <laughs> I think celebrity can also be a little bit overstated here. Um, because if it was just a celebrity thing, the Democrats would win every single time. But it's, that's not how politics works.